Jet Moto 3 is coming. What's in it that's new? You won't have time to ask. Either you splat like a fly on a windshield, or scream faster than ever through some of the coolest places on Earth, and beyond. We got the game's producer to tip you off in advance on what's new, so when you play, you can totally concentrate on saving your butt. We, we wanted to add three different things. One is speed. As much speed as possible. Two was base everything, all the track design off of skill. So you would learn basic skills as you go through the environment and then use those together in combinations of skills later when you get to the hard environment. And the third was we really wanted to take away all the barriers that were in one and two, limiting the player where he can go and where he can't go. And this time, pretty much, if you see it, you can drive on it. We tried to build in shortcuts as much as possible everywhere. Look for them. We also added a few new features. We added uh, stunt mode, uh, which everyone has been dying for. It's a hidden mode, so you're going to have to uh, figure out how to open it. It's pretty much a point-based mode. You have a certain amount of time, and you have to do a certain amount of stunts within that time period and gain enough points in order to progress through uh, five different stunt tracks. In order to get the really high scoring tricks, you got to rotate on all three axes. We added a new hop feature, which is part of the skills that I talked about earlier. And we added horizontal grapples where you can pretty much Tarzan swing using multiple grapples throughout the environment. It's pretty cool. You go through a total of 11 tracks. The last track, Planet X, is uh, extremely hard. Uh, the music on Jet Moto 3 is high energy techno uh, with different styles, loosely based on the environment. We have uh, two people working on them. Uh, Juno Reactor doing some original tunes and uh, Chucky D, our uh, internal guy here at 99 Studios. Nobody knows the game like the producer, and he had this final word to pass along. Okay, here's a hint for the Lost City level. If you want to get through the top of the observatory, don't turbo over the sundial. Just drive over it and hop at the end. There you go. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Eight, nine, studio.